Hello YouTube, this is Everything Epan here, and today I'm doing a video tutorial on how to install Windows 97 in VirtualBox or VMware. This is not a actual operating system just like Windows 99. It was created by somebody else, and it wasn't a release of Microsoft or anything at all like that. It was just somebody else redoing it, saying Windows 97, and it, this one's actually pretty easy. You don't even have to install this. You can just run this. But I'm gonna just, it's gonna be a quick tutorial. And it's uh, Windows 97, it's basically a Windows 95 lookalike. And we'll just go ahead and get straight into it. And the links will be in the description. Um, I don't know if I said this in any of my previous videos, but I took the AdFly links out. I kept the password because I give it to you in the bottom right corner of the video. Plus it's in the description. Now, I could, if you guys want me to do a freaking video on like the password and showing you that it works and everything I might even do that just to prove to you guys everybody's saying oh my gosh the password doesn't work you literally look in the bottom right corner of my video I'll literally even say it right now youtube.com slash everything epan is the password it's in the bottom right corner of the video it's in the description and the thing in the description it takes you to download to a RAR file it gives you the text file in it with the password. No password is on that RAR file. It's as easy. It's really easy. It's not even that hard. So I didn't want to remove it. Um, just honestly for security reasons as well. And also, um, I think it was good that I got rid of AdFly anyway because everybody hated it, and I kind of did too. So it's good that I got rid of it. So enough of me talking let me go ahead and get into the tutorial and let me uh, go ahead and create a new machine yes I am trying to get Windows powered to work which would be in my next hopefully one of my next tutorials if I can get it working so hit new and type in the name and put the version as Windows 95 and hit next leave the RAM where it's at and then create the 2 gig virtual hard drive Go ahead and hit settings, storage, hit the floppy first, and then go find the floppy file, which is called setup. And then you need to and put in the uh, ISO, which is labeled as Windows 97. And then hit OK. And then go ahead and start the machine. load up it'll say starting Windows 97 it'll have this little start menu here where you can choose to start the setup program launch FDIS to manage partitions launch MS-DOS or start Windows 97 on live CD mode so that means you can use Windows 97 without installing it with this option I'll show you that option first then I'll do the setup second so if you do choice number four and hit enter you'll see it says Windows 97 in the logo there and if it says this, just press any key to continue, and it will load up Windows 97. And um, you can kind of go through it. Some of the stuff doesn't like. It's not an exact replica of Windows 95. Like, you can't right-click on my computer. Oops. You can't right-click on my computer and hit properties. It gives you a list of options, and it can't do. I can't do Windows key and R to do like the version and everything so yeah it's not quite the greatest but I figured you know what you guys might be interested in this I have no idea if you would be or not if anybody would be I'm not too sure but now what we're gonna do is we're going to show you the installation part so we're gonna do a restart or we're gonna reboot the computer and hit yes It'll reboot the machine and we'll load up into the uh, options once again. Just choose choice number one. And then click any key to continue. Then here you will click enter. And it says your hard drive will be formatted. Click enter to start formatting. And okay, so never mind. That does not work. I just I I had not tried that before that, so <laughs> just um, disregard the installation then. Um, 
so I guess you can only do the live running of it, the live CD mode. The installation mode does not work. You saw it live right there. I had not tried this before that. I've only tried this option, and this is the only option that works. So, well, that's all right anyway. So, um, yeah, I mean, I don't know if this is going to be anything. I mean, it's just something I guess I kind of had to share just because it's a Windows 97 and I did a Windows 99 so it's like I really couldn't find any other ISOs and I found this one um, so there you go guys that's a quick tutorial on how to install or use whatever you call it Windows 97 in VirtualBox or VMware thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial um, leave a like if you uh, like these videos and share these videos as well comment your ideas down below and do not forget to subscribe once again, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video.